In this video, we will be discussing the fixture library within Mosaic Designer 2. On the Layout tab, the fixture library is located in the top right-hand side. You'll notice that it's organized by fixture manufacturer. When you first download Mosaic Designer 2, it comes with a built-in set of fixture manufacturers. However, this can always be expanded. To expand what fixtures and what fixture manufacturers are present within Designer, click on the Cloud Download item in the top right-hand corner. This will bring up access to the online fixture library. This is a massive library containing all of the profiles that we have for Mosaic Designer. You can very easily search this to look for a specific manufacturer or a specific product. For instance, if I want to find an ETC Desire D22, I can simply type in D22. It will then search through the entire library to find that fixture. If I come in here, I have the option to download the entire ETC library by clicking on that, or I can download an entire fixture library. Because most modern fixtures have multiple modes, we list all of those inside. If you don't know what mode you're looking for in particular, you can select the entire fixture and download all of it. Once you've selected that, you'll see a progress bar for downloading the information. If we go back into the fixture library, we also have the option to check and uncheck all, that we could download every fixture, or select anything that has an update. If I select this, it will go through and update any fixture I've previously downloaded to its current version. Once you've downloaded a fixture and used it in a show file, that fixture is added to the show file. So if I email my show file to another programmer, that programmer doesn't have to worry about downloading it themselves. At the top of our fixture library, we have a couple of other fields. The first one is our main library. This shows all of the fixtures we've currently added to Designer. If we go to the checkbox, this will show all fixtures that are currently used in my show. The clock shows all recently used fixtures. And if we go to the star, it'll show favorites. If I go back to the library and hover over any particular fixture, the little star icon appears on the right-hand side. By selecting the star, I can add these fixtures to my favorite list and have quick, easy access to that. If you're setting up for a programming before actually being on site, I highly recommend favoriting the fixtures you think you'll be using. And remember, if you're having trouble finding a fixture that you need for a project, please contact ETC Tech Support.